This is PB Radio Listening Community. You got Dr. Sharon D again today on Coffee Talk, and I'm excited. But you know, guys, I have a guest with me today, and I'm going to go and start talking about uh, what's happening uh, in Colorado before I introduce this awesome gentleman. But um, I want to say to you guys that whatever's going on, Whatever area you live in, whatever situation you're in, no matter what's happening around you, things that's favorable, things that you feel is unfavorable, you know what? Get up and praise God anyway. Thank Him for just giving you the breath to breathe today, to just move around. Get excited about how beautiful the weather is you know outside now don't get me wrong this week has been whew, the things that have come across my ears and the times that I had to stop and just say okay God it's time to pray you know each moment each day God said pray without ceasing right so you know I have had situations this week it was the taste of Colorado last weekend the Broncos game I mean big things happening here in Colorado that we're all excited about, but meanwhile, uh, I have a young lady that um, I know uh, that had a horrible car accident, and the young man that she hit, or he hit her, however the collision happened, head on, passed on the scene, and I, I, I have to pray for her, because she's, she's in her uh, late 20s, and really, really confused about where to go with this. Um, just the other day, two days ago, uh, I had one of the pastors to call and we touched agreed and agreed in prayer because one of her girlfriends, you know, we still got our girls now. We roll together, ministry or not, we gonna roll together in prayer, lifting one another up, the whole nine yards. You know, well you got Delta and all of that, uh, uh, Chi-Fi and all that, we got the sisterhood, you hear me? And, and we gonna stand on God's word in that sisterhood and build it, you know, and one of the things that she called in and uh, we spoke for a while and, you know, we've been uh, putting together a prayer time and all of that, um, that her good friend lost her husband that morning.